playing out live across Kent. Stormzy and m and blinded by your grace on the hit list on KMFM. You're listening to Glenn Scott Tuesday night and Sigrid is hanging out on the show. And the last time we caught up, it was to promote Don't Kill My Vibe and that track did so, so well. Did you ever expect it to take off in the way that it did? Well, thank you so much for the support and thank you for having us back then. That was really nice. But yeah, the reception of Don't Kill My Vibe has been great. Um, it's been such a fun year and um, no, I did not expect it to be to go that quick. I know, and we loved playing it. And you also had a full festival season under your yeah. belt as well. What was your favourite festival that you played last year? Difficult, so many cool moments, but probably maybe like Glastonbury or Roskilde in Denmark. Yeah, because I remember seeing, because I really wanted to go to Glastonbury last year, um, but I couldn't get tickets because it's so hard to get tickets to Glastonbury. Yeah. And I saw clips of your set and it looked so, so good. Was it your first kind of proper festival season? Yes, my, I've done festivals before, but then not under, because uh, when I was just, uh, I did like a couple of songs in Norway, but then with my full name. And it, this was my first festival season, it's just Sigrid. What's your full name? Sigrid Sulbakrava. Sigrid's easier for me to say, so I'm glad, <laughs> I, I'm glad for the sake of uh, the people of Kent, uh, I'm glad that you've just gone for Sigrid because I would yeah. struggle every single oh, time. Did you spend Christmas in Norway or were you in the UK or in the US? Oh, I was in Norway, yeah, back home with my family, my brother, sister, my parents, and we skied every day. I took my wisdom teeth out. Hold on, you just... took your wisdom teeth out? Oh, not myself. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what I was expecting. Like, we... Oh God, we're not, like, we're, we're civilised in Norway. It's not, it's not that bad. <laughs> I was expecting, you know, when you're a kid and you just had like a wobbly tooth and you had to like tie a little bit of string oh, yeah, around it and pull. Yeah, 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 I was yeah. imagining you doing that of your wisdom teeth. Uh, no, it was no. more complicated than that. Yeah, I can imagine. <laughs> I imagine it's not like the slamming the door shut and pulling the string. Ah. We need to talk about the last time you came down because we spent the majority of the interview talking about The Sims. You were talking about how it was your dream to record a song in Simlish. Yep. A few, I think it was a couple of months after the interview, I saw a news article pop up you did it didn't you yes and i can't remember but i'm pretty sure i knew that that was going to happen when we were at the interview but i couldn't tell it ah you had the ultimate poker face because yes. i had no idea what was no, going I on i think so i'm pretty i'm pretty sure because i, I must have known since i mentioned it yeah. but anyways yeah it happened and it is the greatest probably the greatest moment of my life <laughs> um so much fun a great recording session you know recording don't kill my vibe in simlish i can't believe you fun. knew I feel betrayed. I can't believe I'm we were sorry. It's all right. Because I remember you was, I was said to you, um, what would it sound? What would Don't Kill My Vibe sound like in Simlish? Yeah. And to be fair, you sung it like fluently. And I was like, ah, oh, that's really good. It's really off the top <laughs> of your head. Ah, oh, I've been completely betrayed. So your new single, Strangers, it's out now. It's sounding so, so good when we play it. It's one of well, these tracks that you. just instantly puts you in a good mood. Um, mm. How did that track come about? So that was a song that I wrote with uh, Martin Shirley, the same guy I wrote Don't Kill My Vibe with. It's about the feeling feeling of being strangers together and wanting something to be something it's not and it's an upbeat song but still the theme is quite sad but I like the dynamic of it yeah it's nice contrast because if it's kind of sad lyrics but upbeat because then you're just in your mind you don't really know what's going on so I'm gonna hit play <laughs> on strangers now thank you so much for hanging out on the show no thank you for having me and can I leave you to introduce it on KMFM please of course hi I'm Sigrid and here is my new single strangers on KMFM just like in the- 